Whew. All right, we are back, everybody. Uh, episode five of the LD account. It's been a minute. I know it's been a minute. Um, it's been a quite a busy couple last couple of weeks, not just for the channel, but just, you know, IRL, work, life, uh, family, friends, all that kind of stuff. So it's hard to keep up the, uh, the content creator life. But here we go. We are back here with the LD account. Um, I'm going to start out, give you guys a little bit of an update where we're at. Um, kind of hop into my monsters here real quick. Kind of show you what I, I've typically been running with. So Mara's definitely been kind of a primary DPS for me. Uh, she's helped out in a lot of situations. So really liking Mara. Um, Shushu, obviously, that was like the first secret dungeon monster I went for. Hell yeah, it's an obvious pick for my three-star ticket. Um, we got the Viva Chell, right? Our Nat 5, <laughs> LD Nat 5. Obviously, she's really strong because she's going to help us hit those power limits that we need to get the bonus, uh, being a five star with better stats. So I'm really looking for trying to put some of the best runes that I have on her. Still waiting for some decent uh, legend runes. Uh, I've got a, a couple legend runes running around here. Um, I need to go through my rune box and that'll be something I need to do soon. Been farming a lot. Um, got the Rakuni I throw in there sometimes. Uh, I do bring in the Cheryl sometimes. Um, so I do have a couple monsters leveled up. I got the Cassie at the Teon. Uh, we're going to be breaking out Rumicus today. Uh, he's going to be runed up and used today. Breaking out the Zinc too. Trying to use that on the, um, uh, Rhodes boss, uh, the guard rune boss. Uh, see if the block beneficial effects helps at all. Um, and he applies attack down. So we'll see if that helps a little bit. Uh, I've been ruining him up. Eventually I'll get AV up. But uh, I've ruined up, not ruined up, but I leveled up a couple monsters that help me in the uh, spires. So actually, before we do that, yeah, let's go spires, uh, celestial spires here. We're getting to a point in some of the challenge stages. So let's go like down here. Uh, two night monsters, easy. Place a wind monster, right? And a mage monster. So for the mage monster, I've been tip I built Cheryl here. Right? Is it Cheryl? Or no, this one's Cameron. The light one's Cheryl. Uh, I've been typically running with uh, this one as my mage. And then uh, for a wind monster, uh, I'm what I'm trying to do is throw in uh, free monsters. Um, so I'll throw in the Shannon, right? Uh, or I'll throw in the Naomi because those are both free monsters now. So uh, I'm. Yeah, I could even throw in um, the Celia for that wind monster as well. So that's kind of been my, uh, I guess not my little bit of a cheat in a way. When I do have to use a monster, like an element monster on this account, I'm trying to stick to monsters that are free, right? And pretty much all of these challenge stages, fire monster, archer monster, all of these challenge stages, I should be able to use a free monster, right? Like a Manadon or something like that for the fire and of course archer. So try to do that um, the best I can. I'll let you guys know if we run into a situation where there's like no free monsters to use, but I think we should pretty much have it for all free monsters. Um, there might be a couple stages like I need a wind knight, I think, for one of the expeditions. Actually, I think it's the water roads one. So um, here, we'll use a ticket. So wind knights are very hard to come by and i don't think we have any particularly free ones right so normally i use like rakaja or something like that but what do you guys think would i just use like the um the archangel that i have technically he's a knight uh or what i've actually got him ruined up because i'm trying to send him out on expeditions uh, i'm trying to get to that level two of expeditions with a lizard man or do I go with like three stars? Is that like my caveat? Is that the thing I have to do is use three stars? It's gonna be really tough, but we're gonna do do the best we can. Uh, expeditions, I'm using the free monster. Oh, I'm using Igmanodon here because he was a free monster. So that's what I'm using uh, to do level two and hopefully eventually level three. Uh, what else we got? Path of growth. Let's check this out. Um, honestly, I've just been doing level 15 of the green one. I could go to these. I just have done that um for the rune dungeons i can manual level 15 um this one's i can manual level 14 i just really tough to do um i just haven't really gotten around to do it um level 15 yeah i can manual tier glands uh laboratory is really tough i haven't beaten level 14 yet and lava cave is actually pretty easy especially with shushu so um i can do that one pretty easy i don't know i forget if i can auto this one or not but this one's relatively easy so I'm good with um, all of the dungeons. I'm mostly focusing on Queen Spider Nest uh, and Lava Cave because I want um, Foresight runes and I want those energy runes because um, a lot of my monsters are going to be more like tanky HP monsters since I'm an Orbia, right? Of course, I'm going to have to farm this a lot too for those Blade and Rage runes. Uh, and then Subjugation. Been farming a ton of Subjugation actually, mostly, and this is where we'll kind of switch over. 
because I've been trying to level up blacksmithing as much as possible. So I'm on level six blacksmithing right now. And of course, level six alchemy. Um, try to get there as quick as possible so I could start making these skill books, right? These skill books are super important for your summoner's power. And of course, you know, getting our mystical scroll. So I've been trying to do those skill books as often as possible. Um, and then blacksmithing, I'm trying to get as high up as I can. You can see I've got most of the easy ones done. Um, but yeah, I'm going to be slowly working on this over the next week or two, trying to finish this up so that way I can actually do um, level seven blacksmithing and start doing some of this higher level stuff. Like I've got a decent amount of white castle gear and some foggy gear that honestly the weapons, I don't mind taking the weapons up to six star. I know we just recently had the video about like, what are the best weapons for Orbia and stuff like that? Um, I don't mind too much the weapons. It's actually going to be hard for me to do Naraka. Um, Naraka, I'm nowhere close to doing. I can do White Castle. So let's let's switch over to that. So raids, um, Foggy's easy, done. White Castle, if we have a decent team, we can do the speed run. Um, but I can easily clear the uh, White Castle with pretty much any randos. Um, I have not attempted to do Naraka yet because I am nowhere close to the... Uh, to the bonus or even to the yellow i'm probably close to the yellow let me let me see if i put in my viva shell okay i am at slightly hard here for this so it, it is doable and this is honestly probably the team that i would run i would need some sort of provoker and i need to think about that maybe you guys can let me know down in the comments what would be the best like uh provoke weapon or provoke uh, monster that i could possibly use light and dark uh, we'll have to go in there and and check it out. But yeah, let me know what your what your thoughts are on a good provoke monster or you know a good CC monster, right? Because that's all we need is CC. Uh, it could be a slow, it could be a freeze, any of those sort of things to get through that minion phase. So yeah, I'm really once we can finally get here to Naraka and do this, we're gonna have to farm this a lot because we need accessories from Naraka. That's gonna be my focus and goal is get accessories from Naraka. Um, okay. Another quick updates, um, showed you spires. Um, I've done light and dark. I could probably go a little bit higher on both of these. Um, I haven't touched them in a little bit. I tend to go back to those every week or so. Um, Kairos, I can pretty much do anything I need. It's just Hall of Magic, light and dark. Those are the only things that I do. Um, Secret Dungeons, I've been trying to open these up as often as possible. Not just for new monsters, but also for book stats for like Shushu uh, and for Cassie and things like that. Uh, I think Darien's also going to be important for me, so I need to keep working on getting some Darien pieces. Um, what else? Element towers, crafting spires, expeditions, dungeons. Yeah, that's pretty much everything. So um, let's do this. Oh, arena. I've been um, I've been kind of sitting at like C two here, um, just kind of doing as much farming as I can, hitting that refresh every thirty minutes or so, um, getting as many of these quick battles as I can. As you know that we do. Um, as you can see, I don't have the battle pass or the arena pass on this account, so it's a little bit harder to blow through some of these uh, like I can on my main account, which has the arena pass. So a little bit harder to do that, but I do it as often as I can. And as you guys know, this is definitely like a back burner account. Like I'm not like grinding this account like I would be my regular. So. OK, so um, next three things. So there's the update. Next three things I want to do today. I want to show you guys we'll do summons okay big summon session uh, we will do galagos and we're gonna do some brawl arena okay i haven't done brawl arena i really should be doing brawl arena because i need those coins and those those points right let's start with summon session um okay so let me check my event real quick okay i claimed everything i sent everything good 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 uh, I don't have a water elemental for this, and I don't have a map for this, so I need a, I need a hopefully summon for one of those. Uh, and then there's the the picnic basket. I'll save for that. And then once we're out of these baskets here uh, for this event, uh, then we'll switch over to the meal box, and we'll be able to get some uh, breath of life and sky stones. Actually, a decent amount here. But this picnic basket was definitely the one I went for on my main account and for this account. Uh, legend runes, mystical scrolls, and magic craft tools. That's a uh, that's pretty good. Do I have any of those picnic baskets that we can open? Uh, let's pop these. Uh, let's pop these. Let's make sure we have all of our scrolls available to us. I do have a couple picnic baskets. So let's open our four picnic baskets. Uh, see if we got any runes here. Uh, whatever. 
meh. Like, I'm so picky because I'm thinking about my main account, but I need to not be thinking about that. Yeah, none of these are particularly great. Uh, flat. I, I could see this one, maybe. And, like, maybe. I don't know. I don't know. It's hard to invest a lot of resources into that. Okay, let's head over to our summon session. So, obviously, still got the selective summon, got our light dark. Oh, by the way, if you guys on your main account, summon for Ariel. This man is really, really good. I know we just had Water Vampire, and I did 400 pity on him. Um, but I would, I'm would, hoping I can get enough scrolls to summon for Water Archangel. Okay, so here's what we got today. Uh, we got to pop a ton of unknown scrolls. We got 250 mystical scrolls, you know, obviously the uh, elementals. And we got 10 legendaries. We'll be getting a couple more legendaries as well. So... Hopefully we can get some light, dark, nat fours. That's all we can really hope for right now. And then our four light and dark scrolls. Okay. So let's start this summon session. And blow through some of these. Remember these uh, unknown scrolls can really give us some good stuff. I actually need a water elemental and a mav. Uh, it's something I need like regular element. But of course... Three stars that are LDs and four stars that are LDs. Nice. A new monster. I'll eventually level up all these other monsters for the account points. There's the fire elemental. Don't need that. Uh, let's see. Keep going. Honestly, what I'm kind of excited about, too, is the four stars. Um, I can use their pieces for, like, um, Breath of Life if I really need it. Because um, I'm not going to be leveling up a lot of four star monsters. So it's like I can just use their pieces for Breath of Life. Obviously, I'm going to use their pieces to skill up any nat fours that I have. Okay, so that was all those. So nothing crazy out of the 360 unknown scrolls. Okay, uh, let's use some mysticals. So we're not doing any banners, guys, because banners just like I have. I would rather do my altar's blessing. My altar's blessing is way more important than the possibility of getting a light dark nat five on a banner. Um, just not going to go about that. Uh, speaking of altar, here's what I got in my altar. All my uh, all my light darks. And even though I have them, obviously, I have like Shushu fully skilled up, fully awakened. But we're going to keep Shushu in there because we want uh, we want book stats, right? We want to continue to get higher and higher book stats. So the more that you summon, you can eventually max out their book stats. So I've got all my LDs in here. Um, missing one LD to put here. So I just put um, Meg in here for now. I think Lydia is the light one. She's pretty good. So in case we get her. All right, let's blow through these. Of course, in the altar, I got my Viva Chell. Okay, got uh, another hard here. Blessing, first blessing down. Second blessing down. Uh, book stats on our Igmanodon. That's good. New monster there. Okay, blessing. I think we're fully skilled up on our Rashid. Another blessing. All right. Let's slow it down a little bit. See if we get any out fives. Kind of blowing through these right now. Okay, got a werewolf. Not that we can really use any nat fives. Here's our legendary scroll. Grab that. So yeah, doing pretty good on our blessing so far. Uh, would love to get a Viva Chell uh, blessing. That'll be super important. Keep those. Uh, keep awakening. And of course, get her to max. Uh, max book stats. All right, there's our Vampire Blessing. Or wait. Was he in my Blessing? Why was that not count as a Blessing? Did I just randomly get him? How does that work? Interesting. Can you just like randomly get him and not count for the Blessing? I didn't know that was a thing. So we've gotten the one nat five, and that was the Vertiheal. I mean, if we got a light uh, vampire, that would be pretty phenomenal. 
All right, what are we, about 140 scrolls in now? Seems like my luck. Got another Mara blessing. How are we doing on scrolls? Only 60 scrolls left, man. Jeez. I think that's one nat five. Okay, AV blessing. Okay, uh, Cassie blessing. All right, let's see what we get. Come on. Got a couple more scrolls left. Uh, Gor Gro -go? Grogu? <laughs> Grogu. I don't forget what his name is. The light uh, element tank there. All right, there's a nat 5, finally. Good old natural nat 5. Let's see what we get. All right. Uh, Tyrone? Tyron? So another monster we can't use, but we did get Shumarn. I saw that right at the beginning. We need one more mystical scroll. That sucks. Uh, we did get Shumarn. Uh, he's a pretty strong DPS, even still. Um, next free summon. Oh, we do have two. Here we go. We do have two more. Come on. These are your last chances. You can get a double net. Ooh, there's the blessing on the shoe shoe. We like to see that. And last mystical scroll. Nothing. All right. It's so got the blessing on the shoe shoe. Did pretty good on our blessing. Got some strong monsters here. Didn't get the Viva Chell. So got the Mara. We got the shoe shoe. Uh, we got the Rashid, the Cassie. Yeah, we got we got a lot of stuff. That's good. Um, let's blow through these elementals. I'm just going to blow through these guys because I'm not going to be able to use them for the most part. Uh, unless it's a free monster like Naomi. <laughs> Does count towards the legendary schools, which are nice. All right, we can do a 10 pop of this. All right. We get Epicon Priest, okay. Gotta blow through these because we only got nine of them. Wow, two of those in a row. Three of those. All right, wow, four. There's like four of those, geez. All right, uh, let's do these legendaries first. They don't matter too much to us. Could be a skill up later on down the road, perhaps. Yep. Uh, let's do this one. Let's do water. Nothing. Another harg. I'm fully skilled up on that. Unless I get the light one. Uh, eventually, if I get the light one. And then I'll need harg pieces to skill up. But I'm also going to have a bunch of nat 4 devil mons, so... All right, so that's all those. Uh, we do have legendaries, so let's go ahead and pop these legendaries one at a time. Lots of opportunities for Nat 4s, LD Nat 4s here. Mm, right off the bat, good old Nat 5. Let's see if it's something that we can use. Highly doubt it. There he is. Little Joker. He's laughing at us because we can't use him. All right, let's do another one. Gosh, I'm just, I'm so ready to like go crazy when if we get a nat 5 on this account. Okay, another Harg. Oh, I want a nat 5 so bad. Like, that LD nat 5 is going to be my baby when it comes out. I will love that thing. I will pour all of my best runes into that thing. All of my breath of life will go into that LD nat 5. I swear to you, come to us. Everything I have will go into that nat 5. But it's hard enough to get a nat 5 regular element. Could get an LD here. Come on. Oh, another one. All right, let's go. Come on. Oh, I'm ready to flip out. I'm ready to flip out. Please, please. Ready to play a Requiem? Okay. Oh, I, was like, I saw the purple for a second. Ooh, that's my blessing. All right, we're happy with that, though. I saw the purple. Ooh. 
How many we got left? Seven of these left? Is this enough? Yeah, math is hard. Do we get a transcendence out of this? All right, we got our Heart Magician uh, Blessing, so that's super good. Uh, I'm in a much better guild now. Thank you, uh, Asmodian, for letting me into the uh, Girls Guild. So we can... Uh, I think uh, tomorrow, I think you guys do your guild raid. I'll have to check in on the Discord. Today is Friday, so hopefully uh, I can get this out today. This video. A lot of Chloe's. But yeah, after we do Guild Raid for a couple weeks, I'll be able to get my, uh, get a Celia. And I think Celia is going to be really strong in PvP. Uh, we hosted a little tournament last week, and Celia was actually pretty good. Okay, nothing. All right, that's it. There's our Transcendence Scroll, though. Let's, uh, let's do the Transcendence, and then we'll end it with our Light and Darts. All right? Woo! Let's go! Please. I'll give you everything come to us. It's exciting to play with fire. Ah, uh, I think I already have him too. I do. Uh, I don't know all the words, so I get excited every time. Like, ugh. All right. Four light and dark scrolls ready to go. Nat threes are guaranteed. Possible nat fours, possible nat five. Let's go. All right, nat three, what do we get? Okay, we got the mummy. I don't think he's particularly good. Max HP damage does bleed. Uh, max HP damage dealt up below 50%. Hmm, interesting. Don't think we can use him. All right. Come on, nat four, baby. Nat four, baby. Uh, all right, we got another new one, though. Uh, we got Elpuria. Uh, let's see, defense is damage, so defense removes a benefit, so he strips, which is good. Um, if your current HP is lower than the, current, the target's current HP, then you stun. And then defense up. So nothing crazy. So stunning and removing beneficial effects could be could be kind of fun in Brawl, maybe. I'm excited with this account to, like, later in Brawl when I have, like, a lot of three stars leveled up just to bring some random three stars. All right, last three star. And we got our Imp. Oh, wait. We have one more. Sorry, we have four. Oh, uh, oh, oh, oh. Okay, four star. Come on, four star. New four star. Okay. Okay, I don't have him on my main account. I'm pretty sure, if I'm not mistaken, this is like the light, the Dark Tower King right here, Basalt. Uh, recovers 11.3% of target's HP, okay? Or uh, nearby allies. Applies defense up, which is really good uh, for sustain. Um, does damage based off defense provoke, right? Because he's a knight. And then reduces damage taken by 50% if damage taken at once exceeds 30% of max HP. So it's like he can't really get one-shotted by something. Yeah. Okay. I see this as a really strong unit in the Dark Tower. This I am happy for this. This is a big, this is a big win for me. Excellent. Nice. All right. That uh, concludes our summon session. Let's go uh, level up anything that we can. I think there was a uh, Viva Chell. Uh, Awaken. Yep. So a lot of Breath of Life, but totally worth it because that's how we're going to hit that power level. Um, who, do, who am I using? We are going to be using Charger Shark, so we're going to do that real quick. Uh, I need to get my Zinc higher up too. I need to go, like, trade in a bunch of Breath of Life, actually. Everything here is skilled up. Uh, my Lin is not fully skilled up, though. So let's finish that. So she is finished off with skill ups now. There's a couple other things down here that I eventually want to skill up. Like, so I kind of just, like, go through now. And I know it costs a little bit of coin. But I've just been, like, skilling up a bunch of these three stars that I think that I might use. So it's like, if I think I might use it, I'm just going to... I'm just going to auto-select and 
Because there's a lot of pieces here that I could just use for Breath of Life. And, like, I have to, like, max awaken everything that I have. That's the only way that I'm going to get the power level that I need. And we got a Shumar. New Basalt and Shumar. So let's do Shumar first. Probably don't have too many pieces of him. And it's just the... Yep, we got everything. Nice. Perfect. Uh, was there anything new over here? The light one I don't think is that good. Uh, we talked about him. So, again, I'm just sort of, like, getting rid of all these pieces and using them um, on some monsters. So that way I can just go to the exchange shop and not feel bad about just... Oh, 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 before I do this. Whew, almost forgot. Collection challenge. Um, this. Ooh, almost forgot and got rid of all my two stars again. Ooh, there's some more um, scrolls. You guys want to do a couple more scrolls real quick? Bonus round. Watch the LDs be here. Come on. Give me something. LD4 star. Unfortunate. I got two. One. Two. All right. That was our little bonus round. Um, oh, another uh, bonus round. Mystical Summon event. Second bonus round. Uh, summons. Second bonus round. Got a four star. And do two of these. One. Two. Okay. And legendary. We'll let it ride out. All right. Nice. All right. So I think we, we summoned a ton now. We can go and exchange all of these pieces for Breath of Life. Yeah, they're so expensive. All right. So let's go 99, 999, auto select, boom. 999, auto select, boom. Auto select. God, I got so much in here. It's because I don't really have a lot of monsters to level up. I'll, I'll leave some in here. Um, I did this. Is that is that like awful? Yeah, that's pretty awful. I'm just going to save. I'm just not going to use her. Okay. Um, I want to do a little bit of Brawl Arena. But I've been kind of waiting to do this. Let's get into Arena here. So I'm going to first pick Shushu every time. Because like Shushu is the only meta monster that I have. Ooh, I have 666 Arena Coins. Honestly, what do I buy from Arena Coins? Probably Mystical Scrolls. Like, that's my... It's kind of my go-to, because I just need more monsters, the possibility of more four-stars. Like, everything I have is going into Mystical Scrolls. All right, Santiago Atlas. Aw, they just gave up. I'm not that good, I swear. It's the off account. Get rid of the light one, so he can't strip my immunity. Man, everybody's just leaving. I guess this is what happens when you, like, don't do any brawl for a while. You kind of, like, level up a lot. Alright, that was quick. I'd like to get into gold would be cool. Gold one. Frodo Baggin. He's level 66, so he shouldn't be going anywhere. I can only use my light or dark weapon. That's what, uh, that's what we're going with. Doesn't matter what they pick. Alright, so they have a super bursty team, but Vivichel kind of helps me with that. I'm going to choose the Mara. Because she can go through um, the Thea Mars. And I'm going to keep the Thea Mars. Kind of waiting for some sort of... Hey, got the Ethna. Uh, the Tion is down, unfortunately. Yeah, I think I'm just really outmatched here. Yeah, they're like six levels above. We tried. Got smacked. Yep. 
Yeah, they got a full set of White Castle gear. So I'm probably just going to pick a pretty similar comp. I'm significantly out-leveling him. Yeah. Probably what I should have done with the last guy. A forfeit. He's probably going to leave, too. I guess uh, down here in bronze, it's just so... You never know. You got people that are level 50. You got people that are 66. Okay, bronze three. I'm not going to use all my tickets, but I definitely want to use some of them. I'll probably do a, uh, a bunch off stream, too. Interesting. A lot of nat fours here. Honestly, I don't know what to go for here. Yeah, Blue Cassie is probably the weakest. Wait, isn't this a thing Orbeez do? They just sort of run around and they wait for stuff. Sorry, bud. We're a little outmatched. It'd just be like that. All right. Got our first win in Brawl. Uh, let's take it down to 25. We'll do... We'll go down to 25 tickets. Brawl's definitely not going to be the focus right now. Pumpkin, 37. All right, bud. Just go ahead and leave for me, please. Oh, no. He didn't leave. Maybe he's on his off account or his off summoner, and he's got some really high maxed out monsters. That's what I'm, that's what I'm going to guess. Guess not. Uh, we'll ban. Uh, actually, I'm not worried about the Tarian. Probably got no skill ups into him. He didn't watch my video. It's leveling up all these uh, Nat Fives. Yeah, give me the shoe shoe. Ah, I missed the strip. Ah, I just have no accuracy on my uh, Orbia. I gotta learn the ways of the Orbia. All right, can we get a decent match for our final one? Okay, this should be a decent match. <laughs> Look at the uh, his eyes over there, man. All right, I guarantee you he's not going to pick a Vivichel. But he is going to pick Chloe. Ooh. The the water vampire. The Juno and the Konamiya. We'll ban the Juno because, you know, Juno's broken in every part of the ladder. Come on, take out the, take out the Chloe. Ah, there goes the Tion. 
Man, my Teon's weak. I need... Uh, I keep using that skill. I shouldn't be. The strip skill, because I need it. And the only ult I have is Viva Chell's ult. All right. We like that. Ended off on a nice little win. Let's go look at Galagos. We're going to have to do Galagos um, at least a little bit to get some stuff. So we're basically just picking every monster we have. And that's literally all we can do. Uh, we need at least two mage monsters. So, and a water knight monster. So they're gonna have to. We're gonna have to pick a water knight monster. So we'll go with that. And then another mage monster. Do we have another light dark mage? Actually, very little. Uh, so we're going to have to go with, we'll just go with Azalea since she's a free one. And then we'll pick the rest of our light dark monsters here. Because that's all we got. We'll pick our, our three stars here. All our three stars. There we go. Why not? All right. So we got Galagos. Let's see if we can solo it with Dark Orbia. Literally, this content is absolutely Orbia. Dark Staff. Um, I don't know. We're on auto at the moment. She's doing okay. Oh, we got the bleed. She's not getting as much healing now. I do have those health pots. So that's good. Should probably read her skills and know exactly what I'm doing. Recovers her HP by a portion of the damage down and applies accuracy up to herself. All hits deal damage to enemies around the target as well. Okay, so splash damage. Okay. Yep, yeah, there's that little bit of healing. Uh, this one is summons the power of the universe to apply drain to herself and summons a zone that deals damage to enemies within the area for a fixed period of time. Oh, oh no, oh no. There's that pop. There's the uh, the vampire effect. Yeah, drain damage. Yeah, high level Orbi on Dark Staff, man. Let's heal herself up this whole time. Oh, it's these stuns, man. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Let's do this. Because she's not leveled up. And let's just give her some runes here that are like some HP runes. And we'll just kind of go with that. Um, I forget what she does. So here we go. We're going to find out. So yeah, Orbia just applies Drain to herself the whole time. What does this do? Applies crit attack down and crit rate down to nearby enemies. Okay, that makes sense. And then this one is the heal. Applies defense up to near my allies and recovers their HP. A recovery amount is based off the target's max HP. So it's not going to heal a ton because I have low HP as an Orbia. But it is healing nonetheless. So this should be significantly easier. With a little bit of extra help from AV here. It's actually my first time using AV in both accounts. I can apply that. Yeah, I'll do that first. Let's do the little bit of heals. Okay, apply that. Um, I do have beneficial blocker, which is kind of not good because I can't get the drain effect. Let's finish off these archers. actually really good. Look at all the stuff that she does. Yeah, it's attack down and crit rate down to nearby enemies. It's pretty good. And then I'm applying uh, resistance, right? Down. I think that's what I'm applying. 
Man, these guys are kind of tanky. I don't have any defense breaks, that's why. Oh, 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 no, 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 no. Heal. Let's do the attack right down. There we go. Let's hit that. Heal yourself. Error. Yeah, these are the big damage boys over here. So, hit those guys first. Nice. Okay. Uh, monsters will increase monster crit rate by 20. Increase monster defense, monster precision. I'm going to go with defense because I'm in Orbia now, so I kind of have to focus more on my monsters like health. And then obviously my damage as well. Um, we're going to one of these. Let's see what we get. Sense a cool energy. Summoner HP by 27,000. Uh, increases summoner attack by 1,800. We're going to go with that. Mo damage from my Obia. Actually, I'm going to go boss stage. Uh, we decided we can't really do this alone, so we're going to have to go. Let's go AV again. So let's apply resistance down. Then let's do this. Then let's heal. Oh, look at all that. Orbia's broken. I landed some defense downs uh, with her proc of her passive. Big damage. Heck yeah, look at all that damage. And that's the end. Yeah, we're not doing too bad. Summoner precision. Monster precision. Monster attack. I don't know. Let's just do monster attack. Alright, we got boss stage next. I think we should be able to deal with just AV still. Yeah, that attack down and crit down is really kind of helpful for these situations. It's going to be really helpful for the uh, the Antares later, those liches later. Apply that crit down to everybody. Let's do our ult. Yes. Look at all that damage. Man, it's fun to be an Orbia. All right. I like this, because it's one of the only ways I'm going to get a defense down. Honestly, I'd be happy with clearing floor one. I think I could probably do a couple stages of floor two if I brought all, you know, three monsters with me, especially Vivichel. All right, one little uh, bonus stage. I guess monster attack. That'd be all I need. I apply unrecoverable with my skill three. So does Mara technically. But all I need is uh Shushu's uh cleanse. That's it. So let's just put that up. Let's do the resistance down. Okay, that is a lot of damage. Unrecoverable on him. Got the drain. I am draining all of his life. Come on, Mara, do your thing. There we go. Done. Alright. Oh, okay. Shushu, please. Thank you. Oh, that hurt. Shouldn't be too difficult. Let's keep the immunity up. Oh my gosh, he hit so hard. I would love to get a... Oh, we got him. Okay. That wasn't too bad. He just hit so hard. Okay, Archer type increased the crit rate by 15% crit damage. I do use Mara a lot. So, Mara, I also have Lin. Support type applies level 1 of attack up to itself with 30% chance on me. Eh, someone applies level 1 thirst to itself with a 30% chance if an attack critically hits, replace NSP. Ooh. Boiling blood. Let's go with that. It's, um, mana regen. I'll see what we can do in uh, floor 2. I am expecting to have quite a bit more trouble. So let's go. Yeah, let's go this. Uh, it gives me a little bit extra damage. So let's get in here. Owie. Do that. Um, ooh, snap. Heal. Okay. Yeah, they definitely hit a lot harder. There's also a bunch of these, uh, these copper, whatever they're called. 
Let's do a little bit of that. Let's do an alt. I'll actually be able to use um, Viva Chill later. She has an alt. Let's do Archer type. I'm about to use Mara and Lin and Cassie. I have to switch out the AV for a different monster here. Probably going to be Teon. Yeah, let's use it on these guys. Oof. Gosh. That Orbia damage, though. Okay, Archer-type hits 10% chance to increase the enemy's skill cooldown and apply defense down. We need that later. Whole team applies level 5 continuous recovery and attack up to itself with it. Upon sealing or removing beneficial effects. I don't really do a lot of that. Um, whole team take... Ah, I think I'm just going to go with the Archer-type one. I'm going to use a lot of Archers here soon. Um, let's go boss room, obviously. Nice. Okay. All done. Uh, wow, more archer type. Uh, summoner type, knight type. We'll go summoner. Oh, this is one of these. I've, like, never gotten one of these. Summoner attack. Let's see. Yeah, I like this. 100%. Give me more defense downs. Get closer to the end quicker. Uh, I'm trying to think if I have any. Uh, we'll just do the support type, just because I am using a lot of supports. More warrior. Okay. Defense up. Yeah, I like that. It's every 15 seconds. Uh, let's go here. Maybe there's a chance to get some seal pieces or some seal uh, materials without having to do seal. <sighs> uh, Naraka horns will take. All right, we are almost there. We got a boss battle and a boss battle. I'll be done with floor two. So we're going to go Teon, Air, and Croa. Oh, no. Come back. Teon. Oh, my. Why is my Teon so squishy? I feel like he was really squishy in Brawl, too. Now I have no healing. I guess I just need a... Maybe I just switched to Shushu or something. Man, that hurt a lot. I uh, probably need some extra damage here. Had a lot of... I used an ult, used all kinds of stuff there. Okay, last stage here, let's see. Mage type, that's me. Oh. That's pretty good. Don't get one-shotted. Alright, what do we got? Um, Double Borbo, and then all the mages. Let's bring in triple support. We just need to stay alive long enough to be able to uh, uh, delete some of these mages. Tian again, just getting wrecked so hard. Owie. It's actually working out pretty well. Just all the healing. Let Orbia do all the work. That Shushu is obviously OP here. Because they land a lot of defense breaks and brands and things when they hit you. Okay. Uh, is there one more Spectre Major? He's dead. Okay. I can just focus on these guys. Oh, someone just died. Viva Chill just died. Yeah, his ult's not too scary. I'm just stuck in this animation, though, when I do this, and that's what's sucked. Okay, I need to get out of here, heal up first, get switched to Teon. Okay, that's doing that. I can do my Teon here in a second. My Shushu should be able to do his skill there. Come on, do your skill. Heal up. Why are you not using your skill? Oh, no. Probably shouldn't have used that. Um, okay. Okay, got the dark one down. 
Um, four minutes, I got this. I guess I could trade, I could bring in somebody else. Okay, got the defense down. Now it's just one of them. I can kind of like focus up a little bit here. Yeah, it's just one of them, so it's not, not hard at all. Alt. That should kill him. Nice. All right. Woo. Legend. Monsters take 40% less damage from skills, but 40% more damage from basic attacks. What? I don't like that. That's a... That's kind of dumb. All right, we're doing pretty good here. Uh, level three. I don't think I'm going to make it very far in level three. I do want to break out, though, the Charger Shark. Okay, so I think I'm going to do... I'm going to get rid of Shushu. We're going to go Tion. Actually, let's go Croa Rumicus. Let's do this for that. Definitely have a lot more monsters here, so we got to be careful. Oh, yikes. Oh, and he's dead. I just say. Uh, dang it. It just has. It's so. So weak. So tanky. Like, I need him to be tankier. Oh my gosh. There's way too many monsters going on right now. And they are just instantly dead. Oh my gosh. This is the end of the road. Well, gentlemen, we have found the end of the road. Floor three. First floor, double undines. Uh, they're support monsters that absolutely just clapped my cheeks. So that's where we're at. All right, guys. That uh, I think that wraps up our Galagos adventures. We have 34,000 coins, and guess what we're getting? All of the light and dark legendary scroll pieces. That's all I care about. I honestly don't even care about the devil mine. I really don't. Um, I would love to get the refining catalyst and I'll have to do that later on once I'm able to get more, but I want to get as many of those pieces from the light and dark skulls. Um, because I need more monsters, right? That's the whole point. All right, guys. Um, that was pretty cool. Uh, we were able to get through a lot of Galagos all the way through floor one and two on our little mini Orbia, but I think we're going to be hard stuck at one, one for a second. So uh, next season, we'll be able to bring in a lot more monsters. Uh, we'll be significantly higher leveled up. Uh, but yeah, outside of that, the account's going really well. I'm really enjoying it. I'm going to keep uh, pushing. I'm going to keep grinding on it. Uh, make sure to head over to the main account. Got a lot of videos over there for you guys, especially my new people uh, from the global servers. All right, guys, uh, that's going to be it for me. I will catch you guys in either the next live stream or the next video. Peace.